Have you ever wondered what a tsunami is? Or perhaps pondered on the sheer power these colossal waves hold? Today, we delve into the heart of these natural disasters, unveiling their mystery and the threats they pose to our world. A tsunami, a term derived from the Japanese language, means harbor wave. It's a series of ocean waves with long wavelengths and period caused by large-scale disturbances of the ocean, such as earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, glacier carvings, and even meteorite impacts in the ocean. While many people imagine tsunamis as a singular giant wave, they are in fact a series of waves known as a wave train. The first wave in a tsunami is often not the most destructive. Successive waves can be bigger and more destructive, and the danger can last for hours after the first wave hits. So, how does a tsunami form? It all starts with an undersea disturbance, typically an undersea earthquake. When the seafloor abruptly deforms, it displaces the overlying water from its equilibrium position. This displacement produces an upward force that lifts the water column above, triggering the tsunami waves. The waves ripple out across the ocean, away from the earthquake's epicenter. In deep water, these waves can pass by vessels undetected, as they are only a few centimeters high. However, as they approach the shore and the sea shallows, the tsunami slows down but increases in height, forming towering walls of water that can cause massive destruction. Tsunamis have been responsible for significant loss of life and billions of dollars in damage throughout history. Their power is immense and their reach global. Areas at greatest risk are those nearest to the tectonic plate boundaries, particularly around the Pacific Ocean's Ring of Fire. This area is home to 75% of the world's active volcanoes and sees 90% of the world's earthquakes. But bear in mind, Tsunamis can strike any coastline given the right conditions. To summarize, a tsunami is a series of powerful ocean waves caused by large-scale disturbances such as undersea earthquakes. They start as small ripples in the deep sea but grow in height as they approach the shore, causing widespread destruction. Areas around the Pacific Ocean's ring of fire are at the highest risk. However, no coastline is completely safe from a potential tsunami. Understanding tsunamis and the threats they pose allows us to better prepare and protect our communities. Knowledge is power and in this case it could be a lifesaver.